Hello friends, welcome you in the Abhimanyu IS. My name is Pravesh Watts and I warmly welcome you in the Issue and in the Analysis series. Where we talk about what sports can be fundamental rights, what can be fundamental rights, what can be fundamental rights, and what can be recent to this, what can be fundamental rights, what can be fundamental rights. So, today we will see that one by one. So, let's see. Supreme Court has timely sought the opinion of the center and the state governments. कि हमें सजेशन दीजिए आप कि क्या करें फिजिकल लिटरेसी और स्पोर्ट्स पे रिकॉग्नाइज फंडामेंटल राइट और नॉट सुप्रीम कोर्ट टाइमली टाइमली ये पूछ रही है सेंट्रल एंड द स्टेट गवर्नमेंट से कि क्या स्पोर्ट्स को फंडामेंटल राइट फॉर्मली डिक्लेयर कर देना चाहिए या नहीं देन सुप्रीम कोर्ट ये भी कह रहे कि ऑल एजुकेशन बोर्ड शुड इंश्योर एटलीस्ट नाइनटी मिनट्स ऑफ एवरी स्कूल डे टू बी डेडिकेटेड टू फ्री प्ले एंड द गेम्स यानी ओपन गेम्स आप कराएं इस 90 मिनट्स में आप स्पोर्ट्स एक्टिविटीज कराएं आप पीटीज एक्टिविटीज कराएं ताकि 90 मिनट्स एटलीस्ट आप उस बच्चे का एक ब्रेन जो है स्पोर्ट्स के प्रति डेवलप करें दिस इज द मोस्ट स्ट्रेसेबल एस्पेक्ट विच द सुप्रीम कोर्ट इज टस्ट देन इन द बॉम्बे डाइंग केस 2006 थाउजेंड द कोर्ट गेव अ फ्यूचरिस्टिक विजन फॉर द स्पोर्ट्स की स्पोर्ट्स के लिए क्या क्या कर सकते हैं तो इन दिस वर्ड इट द कोर्ट स्ट्रेस ऑन दैट ऑल्सो एंड आफ्टर दैट कुछ पेटिशन फाइल हो रही हैं हमारे यहां इन डिफरेंट कोर्ट्स रिगार्डिंग टू मेक स्पोर्ट्स अ फंडामेंटल राइट तो क्या डिमांड किया जा रहा है कि स्पोर्ट्स टू बी ट्रांसफर टू दी कॉन्करेट लिस्ट बिकॉज करंटली द स्पोर्ट्स इज इन दी स्टेट लिस्ट एंड देर इज अ डिमांड फॉर इट्स बेटर इंप्लीमेंटेशन अक्रॉस कंट्री सो दैट कि आप इसको कॉन्करेंट लिस्ट में डाल दीजिए तो वेयर द यूनियन इन द स्टेट बोथ हैंड इन हैंड कैन टेक सम इनिशियटिव स्टेप्स Need of amendment in education policies to promote sports and make it enhanced opportunities for sports. यानी अभी तक जो हमारे opportunities हैं sports की वो हैं लेकिन वो for the name sake हैं they are not that much developed. And what happens is that whenever the Olympic comes, whenever a mega sports event comes, only then we remember sports. Only then we say the word sports from our mouth. Otherwise, we just talk about the education. and other things though they are important but still that is the major part of a personality development of a character development there is a demand of establishment of national physical literacy mission jaise hamare yahan digital literacy mission hai is tarike se aisi demand ki ja rahi hai ki aapke yahan physical literacy mission bhi hona chahiye ki physical qualities ko kaise enrich kiya jaye physical standards ko kaise uplift kiya jaye because if the physical standards will be good so the human development will happen more economy will be in a better position because less burden will be on the people for their health and the health issues then need of considering sports as a fundamental right why there is a need kyun hi hum sports ko fundamental rights darja de kya aisi zarurat hai so see physical activity is fundamental to human beings our primary task is not to study our primary task is to play so it is more fundamental than the education if we look specifically it is part of elementary education because in the elementary educations a number of sports activities are done in schools in college in schools where the sports activities are being provided in the form of pts number of sports games number of sports meets number of sports events also so ek elementary education ka part bhi hai then enhance the enjoyment of other fundamental rights for example right to life and personal liberty if we talk so right to life and personal liberty is a vague is a very broad fundamental right lekin if you do not have the proper health and usko banane mein jisme sports ki ek aham bhumika hai agar aapke paas health hi nahi hai to you cannot expect that article 21 right to life and personal liberty you can enjoy if we talk about the educational rights religious rights every right is almost depends on the your physical standards your physical qualities and if they are good so you can easily enjoy your all other fundamental rights then enhance the living conditions improve your health mental and personality development so overall personality development is done with the help of sports so that is the most important reason and i would say these all are the most important reasons because of which there is a need to provide the status of fundamental rights to sports also as per the scenarios 
देन वॉट इज द वे फॉरवर्ड करे तो करे क्या बिकॉज द सुप्रीम कोर्ट हैज आस्ट फ्रॉम द सेंटर एंड द स्टेट बट सेंटर एंड स्टेट हैज नॉट गिवेन अ प्रॉपर एंड अ स्टैंडर्डाइज आंसर टू द गवर्नमेंट टू द कोर्ट सो वट इज द वे फॉरवर्ड स्पोर्ट्स इज अ स्टेट सब्जेक्ट हैंस यूनिफॉर्मिटी अक्रॉस द स्टेट्स इज ऑफ अटमोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंस अगर स्टेट में भी रह के हम यूनिफॉर्मिटी ला पाते हैं तो देर इज नो नीड देर इज नो एनी अर्जेंसी टू ब्रिंग इट इन द कॉन्करेंट लिस्ट इफ ऑल द स्टेट गवर्नमेंट आर दैट मच विलिंग दैट मच लीडिंग their path towards the sports development and provide equal sports opportunity to all the youth across the country because what happens that number of times the incidents comes where the sports agencies and authorities gets complaints from the sports um, from the sportsmen from a number of other people because of their lack of providing guidance lack of providing support to the sportsmen into their early stages which do not provide them a better way of becoming sportsman so ye sari cheeze hain jiski wajah se jo sports authorities hain wo criticize bhi hoti hain lekin agar government jo hai apne apne level par ek uniformity la paaye standardized mechanism la paaye so we do not have any sort of need to bring it to the concurrent list state this mein bhi reh ke ho sakta hai needs to take collective action to create a proper environment where the talent of youth is timely sported and developed in right earnest aur yahan par hamare जो स्पोर्ट्स के फेडरेशन हैं जो स्पोर्ट्स के एजेंसीज हैं उनका एक इंपॉर्टेंट रोल आता है ताकि वो इस तरीके से कार एंड डी रिसर्च एंड डेवलपमेंट करें अलग अलग एरियाज में अलग अलग रीजन्स में ताकि ये पता लग पाए टाइमली कि किस बच्चे का कितना कैलिबर है वो कितनी आगे जा सकता है एंड उसको राइट अर्नेस्ट यानी राइट डायरेक्शन में उसको डेवलप करें ताकि वी गेट अ नंबर ऑफ मेडल्स इन दी ओलंपिक्स एंड अदर स्पोर्ट्स इवेंट्स नीड टू इंटीग्रेट स्पोर्ट्स विद मेन स्ट्रीम एजुकेशन to introduce sports culture in india because currently what we are having is educational culture we are not having sports culture if we talk about the neighbor countries like china and the other and if we talk about the us so number of higher medals comes with the china if we talk about in the asian countries but why not in india though in india also we have a lot of caliber in the sports but still we are lacking behind the reason being the talent is going wasted because of known identification of it because of known support by the government by the federations by the sports agencies to wahan par hame kaam karne ki bahut zyada zarurat hai and more budgetary allocation to sports is required along with the awareness generation in the society we have to generate an awareness in the society that sports is not a secondary to education sports is co equivalent to education jitna zyada education mein bright future hota hai utna hi sports mein hota hai we have to create such kind of positive awareness generation into the society and along with that more budgetary allocation is duly required taaki jo sports agencies hain wo bhi financially stable ho paaye robust ho paaye acche se trainings kara paaye acche se support system de paaye and acche se ek sport culture ka nirman kar paaye in the country so if we talk so that what is the conclusion of this video so i would say that the conclusion remains debatable the reason being the court has asked the government has not given the answer so what we can do is we can just talk about the reforms we can do in the sports culture and we have to consider this fact also that sports if not declared a fundamental right but still it is part of the fundamental rights hence it is very fundamental to the human existence which everyone should understand and should take important steps for its better development for its better endeavor thank you so much and we'll meet on the next day with the next topic thank you